That's crazy. How did shipping just go up to $200? It was just $120. I got me fucked up. <laughs> like an hour and I already made my breakfast and this is usually <laughs> where I like sit I sit at the counter and I usually watch TV and I have my planner out and my computer and I just go through my email so right now I'm just going through my emails and seeing everything that I have to do today um, I think so yesterday I sent in the deposit for my reorder of my edge control and then today so I can have to order those too so uh, today I have to order um, my containers and my lids. So I have to order my containers and my lids for my edge control and then I just send them straight to my manufacturer. Um, and then I just send her like a confirmation or like a tracking number so she know when, uh, when she needs to look out for them. And then I already ordered my labels. So my new labels come, I can show you guys them. I tweaked my edge control labels a bit. They're supposed to come on Friday. Okay. <clears throat> So I added um, the Facebook and the Instagram to it, like just in case, you know. So I have it on the deep conditioner. So this is what I use to create my labels. Um, I don't buy my labels from them because they're not like super professional. Like they don't have like, my first batch came from them. And if you guys ordered my first batch of edge curls, you know the labels like rubbed off. Like they weren't like weatherproof. It said weatherproof, but they weren't. Like if they got wet or anything, they like start messing up over time and they start peeling. And I didn't like that. So now they're like this shiny laminate material almost. Um, so those are my barcodes that I made that go on the bottom. And then I think this is, yeah, so this is, the one I made for my deep conditioner and I already had um, this on there for that one and you know 2019 everything is social media like based influenced and all of that so I went ahead and redid it um, and added it to uh, the edge control so those are coming on Friday hopefully Thursday because Amazon is out of edge controls right now and I do have I have about 140 edge controls right now in my uh, little storage closet um, <clears throat> but uh, I have I'm going to send one box and one box usually has about 128 in there so I'm gonna send 128 to Amazon but I ran out of labels um, so I'm waiting on those labels to come and then I can put the labels on and then send those to Amazon and then I also have to send let me write all of this down I also have to send um, I have to send Amazon deep conditioners because they only have I think seven deep conditioners left so let me see I also when my new batch comes I'll be in the UK so right now I have um right now I have edge controls here in the US I have edge controls on Amazon Canada and then I'm working I've been working for like four months to get them in the UK and I finally got approved to sell on Amazon in the UK so when my new batch comes in I'll be able to send a box out there for you guys so you guys don't have to pay like the crazy shipping that's out here so we're going <clears throat> to New Orleans in two weeks and I have no clothes y'all like I don't know what is this I have no idea what I'm going to wear uh, out there last time we went it was freezing and we went for the last week of Mardi Gras and it was just so intense it was like so many people um there and it was just like we're never coming back during Mardi Gras again like bucket list checked off because it was like literally the streets were like shoulder to shoulder that's how crowded it was that's crazy how did shipping just go up to $200 it was just 120 I got me fucked up Okay y'all, so I got that situation handled. So my price was $7.82 for 1,100 jars and 1,100 lids. And I um, ended up talking to someone because I was like, no, that's not, you can't just jump $100 like with shipping like that. Cause it's not right. Like I've never paid that much. And I ordered from this place like every three months. 
Um, and so I clicked the little chat box. If it was probably a phone, I probably wouldn't have called, or maybe I would have, I don't know. I don't really like talking on the phone, but it's 2019, I don't know, 2019 Brianna may have called. Um, but yeah, I clicked the chat box and I spoke to someone and she got my order down to $666.25. And not only is that almost $120 less, it's a little less than $120, but almost $120 less, but I'm getting 1,280 jars and 1,280 lids. So not only am I getting more, but I'm also paying less. So always, always, always talk to somebody, even if they say no. Okay, so what? You were gonna probably pay it anyway, but just in case, like just always talk to somebody because $100, like I can go to Sephora. <laughs> Yeah, that's where I'm going. You want what? Yeah. You pick me up. Oh, oh thank you. Not too big. Okay, sister. What's that? This a pretty cold. Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. What is in my hands? What you want? Why? You heavy. Steph, like, Steph, this is a pretty car. Dude, if you, <laughs> where you going? What you doing, huh? I said, thank you, this is a pretty car. Ooh. You cute. You cute. Thank you. That's mine. What, what you doing? Oh, you, <laughs> what are you doing? Huh? I don't believe you. <laughs> what are you doing? Okay, I want to eat my cake. I want to eat my cake. I want to eat my cake. Take a picture of me. Thank you, Heidi Potato. Take a picture of me. Bart, why are you acting like this? <laughs> so I'm back home. I got to play with my babies today and I'm trying to figure out what to eat. I'm still letting my curls dry right now. I filmed a wash and go for you guys. Um, and my curls came out really good so far. Like this is what they're looking like. Um, but it's still a little damp, so I'm waiting for it to fully dry. Um, and I kind of want to try um, the rice water. Like, not like a challenge, well, maybe like a challenge. Kind of like a rice, what is that on the side? Oh my gosh, that scared me, I thought it was a spider. Um, I kind of want to try the rice water, uh, like a little challenge because my hair is short. And I don't know about you guys, but when people be doing like these grow your hair real quick things, like, I don't really be believing them until like I try to do it myself. I don't know, like, it's like, are you really pulling the same piece out and telling me that it's growing like five inches or like, you could be pulling a completely different piece of hair. Like, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I just don't trust it. Um, so I kind of want to try it just because my hair is short and we will really be able to tell like if it works, but then I don't, I don't want my hair to grow. So it's like, it's like, what do I do? Do I try it and then my hair grows and then I just cut it back? Or do I try it and then my hair is growing like crazy and I just keep doing it and I let my hair grow like, I don't know. You guys tell me, what do you think? Do you think that I should do the rice water, like a rice water challenge maybe for like, like two weeks, two, three weeks, maybe a month um, and see how it works because these results that I keep seeing because I keep watching the videos, they keep popping up on my timeline. Um, so I kind of want to try it. And then if it's just like, I don't know, then just cut it maybe. And then it'd just be like a video for you guys. But, um, yeah, so my hair's still not dry yet. Um, and I took food out. I was gonna make Cajun shrimp pasta, but my boyfriend just texted me and said, uh, get dressed. So that means we're going to eat. Um, so yeah, I'm going to, I guess, put these shrimp in the refrigerator. Maybe I'll make like a shrimp omelet or something like that in the morning. Um, and we're going to eat, y'all. Okay, so Zumba is over. Everyone is back in their cars. And I think we're about to go to Target. 
Um, it's actually kind of hot today. What time? It says it's 77. That's really good because it's been really cold. Um, I'm fucking sweating. <laughs> I think I'm about to go to Target. Where am I? Let me see. I knew I should have wrote a list. Dang. Okay, I'm gonna go to Target and wing it. Hopefully I don't spend too much money. Okay, so I'm back home. Luckily I have this cart that my mom gave me because I would not be able to get the groceries in the house by myself. And my labels came. So this is, come on, focus. This is what they look like, it's upside down, but I added the Facebook and Instagram little thing to it. So I can finally put those um, on. And so I can finally put those on for Amazon and finally ship that out. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, I'm putting groceries, but I'm gonna cut this heater off. Got the heat on. It's hot in here. Cut that off. And now I can show you guys everything that I got. Put my label. Um, so I got, I needed paper towels and I needed more tissue. So I got this and then I ended up getting from Sprouts. I got my oats for my smoothie um, and I got my medjool dates for my smoothie. Y'all think I'm playing with this weight gain y'all? I am not, okay? Um, and then I got two box hair dyes for one of the wigs that I want to color. Hopefully it comes out how it is in my head. Um, bread for breakfast. I got, um, this used to be my favorite L'Oreal um, eyebrow pencil. I don't wanna focus y'all, um, but come on. Like why are you focusing this one? This is my favorite L'Oreal eyebrow pencil when I first started wearing makeup. So I figured I'd go back to that. And then I just got my favorite drugstore liquid liner and it's super cheap. It's like $2.99 with Wet n Wild. Um, and it works just like the Sephora one. And the Sephora one I think is $16. Um, so save them coins. Um, and then I got protein bars um, because I told you guys I'm gonna start back working out and I like to snack on these when I wake up early and I can't like I can't eat as soon as I wake up. I just, I don't know why, I just can't. So these are quick. I usually just eat these like when I'm in the car, on the way to work out, if I'm going to Skylar's house or we're going to the stairs or from home, I'll just take one of these out and eat it before I start. Uh, so I don't feel like I'm gonna pass out when I'm working out. I got bagels because I walked by and I was like, oh my God, I haven't had bagels in a long time. <laughs> so I got bagels and I got cream cheese. What is this? This is what we used to have when I used to uh, work, me and Eric used to work together. They used to always bring um, the jalapeno, spicy jalapeno cream cheese. So I got this because I walked by and I seen it. I actually seen this first before I seen the bagels. And I was like, yep, getting bagels. So I got that. I got some spicy hummus. Um, paper towels. These I like to keep in my bathroom because I like to... Um, they're easy to grab and I just, <laughs> I just like them. Um, and I don't use like washcloths on my face. I always use paper towels and I just, I just like having those. Um, if I don't have those, I use regular paper towels. I'm just being extra when I buy these, honestly. Um, mouthwash. Simply Lemonade Juice. Um, then I needed lotion. I'm going to make my body butter, but just in case when I run out, like I don't be having anything. So I just got this Dr. Till's Nourishing Coconut and Essential Oils Body Lotion. Um, and then this will be for when people come over and I'm not giving them my body butter. <laughs> no, I'm playing. I will, but just in case, you know. Um, this I'm supposed to be drinking right now because I'm hungry, y'all. So I just got a naked juice. I'm about to drink that. I got the Kinky Curly, not today. I've actually never tried this line before. Um, and it was always between Kinky Curly and Shea Moisture when I first start trying to wear my hair curly. Like, I've been natural my whole life, but I had heat damage because I used to bleach my hair a lot. I dye my hair a lot, straighten my hair. Literally, religiously, every Friday I used to straighten my hair. 
Um, so when I tried to not transition because I didn't have a relaxer or anything, but tried to start wearing my hair curly, um, I all just automatically went to Shea Moisture because most of the videos on YouTube at that time were Shea Moisture. Um, so I just never got around to the kinky curly knot today. So I figured I would just get it because I'm looking for a leave-in anyway. And I've heard so many good things about this literally for years and they're still like, a good brand um like still a known brand like people still use it so it's like i'm gonna get that as my leaving and try that one out i got mango slices y'all just like fruit so i got mango slices paper towels not paper towels paper plates because nobody wants to wash the dishes this is literally my favorite juice, juice. simply balance orange peach and mango juice bomb only find it at target um, and it's really good with mimosas. It's really good in smoothies. It's really good by itself. I just love it. Um, chicken breast, because you could just, you know, never have enough chicken. So it's the weekend, so I probably won't be cooking, but I'm going to freeze that. Um, and then I got plates. Love snacking on these. Uh, prosciutto, like cheese wrapped in prosciutto. It never, never wants to focus for me. So this is what it's right here. Love these, love these. I know a lot of y'all don't eat pork, but I do. So I like those. Cocoa butter, just cause you just gotta always have cocoa butter. I got facial wipes. These are my favorite makeup remover wipes um, by Pacifica and I absolutely love these. Um, these are the rose water one. I actually have the coconut water one, I think. The blue one. I have that one open right now. Um, but I don't have sensitive skin, so when I use it, it's perfectly fine. It takes my makeup off. But when La and Erica used the blue one, they said it burned like around their eyes and around their nose because they both have sensitive skin. So I went back to these, uh, especially for them, like when people spend a night. I don't want to fuck their face up, you know? So going back to the rose water got my detergent so i can finally finish washing and then i just got a 24 pack of water um so yeah now i have to put all of this stuff up and it's saturday it's really nice today especially because it's been cold um so we're all gonna go to erica's house and she's gonna cook because <laughs> my leggings is sagging um she's gonna cook and stuff so i'm gonna put this stuff up um eat something really quick Hop in the shower and then I'm going to Erica house and I can just edit over there. Like, we ain't gonna really be doing nothing. So I'm just taking my computer and my videos because I have <laughs> like four videos that I need to edit. Um, so I'm gonna take those with me. And yeah, that's pretty much it for today. I think so. So I have to do my meat like this when I buy a lot because I live by myself. Um, and if I freeze the whole thing, then they'll get stuck together. Then I have to unthaw the whole thing. And then I have to cook the whole thing. And I live by myself. And I I try to meal prep sometimes. But most of the time, I don't. And because I know I'm probably not going to meal prep, um, I'm just separating them so that I can pull them out as I need them. And not have to cook everything at once. So then I just have them individually packed. And I can freeze them now. So yeah, I had my computer up here because I uploaded a video for you guys. Um, it's a vlog. So I'm getting good, y'all. I'm getting good. So I uploaded a vlog. And I'm so tired, y'all. Like, I've been up, um, like, editing literally all morning until now. Like, I filmed six videos within, like, the last week. Um, and I edited three of them today. I edited the vlog that went up. I edited 
um, a makeup look um, that I did in my synthetic Sunday video. A few of you guys asked for that, so I edited that video. Um, and then I edited my giveaway, my Who Wants It Wednesdays. Um, I edited a video for that because I know a lot of you guys keep asking me if I'm still doing it. And yes, I'm starting those back, so that video is done. Um, and then I have three more videos to edit and two videos to film tomorrow. And I have to pack for New Orleans because we're going to New Orleans on Saturday and I have nothing packed. But I get a shipment coming in tomorrow from Boo Boo. Um, and hopefully all of my stuff is in there and I can like get stuff out of there. I am going to stop talking right now and I'm going to watch Bob's Burgers. I'm going to turn that up and I'm going to start labeling. I don't even know what I'm doing, I'm just moving stuff now. So today is a Monday, it is like 3.30 right now, um, and I've already did all of my orders for the weekend. I'm getting ready to go to the post office, and then I finished labeling um, my edge controls. So they have the top label, the bottom label, and then the Amazon labels on them now. Um, so I have 100 of these that I get to box up now and send to Amazon, so you guys don't have to worry about it not being in stock anymore. It usually takes about a week or so. I think I told you guys this last night. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead, Seal this box up, put the my packages into this little carrier, and then I'm gonna go to the post office. I have filmed this look for you guys. This is all drugstore makeup, a nice glowy, kind of dewy foundation routine. Um, just because a lot of my favorite products are from drugstore, so I was like, why not just do a video on it? And I had to do my makeup anyway because I'm filming another video later. Um, so I filmed this video already earlier today. I did my orders, I did the labels, now I'm gonna drop them off, and then I'm gonna come back and film another hair video for you guys. I'm finally gonna show you guys how I pluck my hairlines. Um, for my wigs so be on the lookout for that if it's not already out um and yeah i'll probably stop and get some food because i am hungry and i've been in the house all day i've been in the house all day yesterday all day today and it's time for me to go out okay guys so i'm back home from dropping everything off i left my camera um and i didn't end up stopping to get any food but i'm so tired y'all I'm so tired, Zumba's at seven, so I have to be ready by 6.30, and I wanna film another video, so I have to keep this makeup on because I have to wipe it off for Zumba. So I have two and a half hours to film this video for you guys. Um, hopefully, it's a one hit or quarter, I'm tired, I just like ran up the stairs. Um, but I came home to my Boohoo package. Make sure I'll show you guys my address. So I came home, my Boohoo package is here, and I'm so excited because it came just in time for New Orleans because a lot of this stuff I think I'm gonna take with me. Um, but I am gonna do a try on haul for you guys. Um, should be up this week, really soon. Um, so it might be up before this video actually. So I'm gonna go ahead and start filming this other video for you guys um because i don't want to have to put my makeup back on tonight um so yeah let me go ahead and go into my beauty room and set up shop so lights on still a little messy in here but these are the lights that i use um just two soft box lights and then this is a ring light that i got from newer this is, came in clutch i want to get a devo ring light because they're a little bit bigger but they're more expensive i've been having this one for like um what like four years three years almost four years and it's working just fine so that's why i'm like not in a rush to get a new one um but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and set up shop to start filming for that i need to eat something first though and I wanna go through this boohoo stuff. <laughs> so I opened it up, I know I'm wasting time, I'm supposed to be filming, but they sent me almost everything. I think, I can't even remember everything that I ordered, but it's so much stuff. I'm so excited. That's a slipper. Ugh. I got hella sweaters and stuff just because it's freezing and I know it's gonna be really cold inside New Orleans, but so many goodies. <laughs> 